What's up guys, welcome back to Big Money Fishing. We're out here at Bronick Lake. Man, I know I haven't been out for a while. It's been raining, thundering, lightning. It just hasn't been the right weather to make it out here. But finally, we're back out here. And it's super muddy, check it out. You can see where I almost busted my butt a few times. It's all slick. Check it out. Hopefully I don't bust my butt, but if I do, hopefully I catch it on camera. So. Hopefully we catch more than just me falling. Um, hopefully we catch, hook up into a couple big old reds out here. Um, see what see what this weather brings us. See how these fish been been biting since all this thunderstorms and things that just been pushing through. We've been having a lot of thunderstorms. So if you're from San Antonio, you're from Texas, you know what we've been going through. So it's just been crazy, but. Let's see what we could hook up into. Like I said, welcome back and let's see what we get. didn't take it. Hmm. Small guy, small guy. Probably a little bait stealer. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna wait fish here in a little bit, but fortunately I gotta wait fish in my regular clothes because I ended up getting a hold of my waders. That sucks. Um, I got them at home. I'm going to patch them up. I've had them already for like two years, but I think it's almost time for a new pair because I think they're leaking from the seam, from the seams too. So, um, but I think I'm going to patch them up for a little bit, give them a couple more trips out and go from there. Yeah, I just had those ones from Academy, the Magellans. Uh, maybe I should just take them back, see if they warranty them. I'm not sure if they had any kind of warranty. Uh, but yeah, so the way I'm dressed, that's the way I'm gonna go in. So water's water felt warm. I put my feet in there, touched it with my hand, so it's kind of warm. So that's a good thing. So we'll see what happens. I've been getting little small bites on these smaller rods here, but nothing big. They're not committing. They just nibble, 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 and let go. So hopefully we cook up into some big ones here. I really don't want to wait for some kind of just casting from the from the bank. But we'll see what happens. See. Right after I said I wasn't gonna get in, I decided I'm gonna get in. Just because I feel I gotta get my rod wet, my my bait all the way into some channel that I know there's a channel somewhere right out there. And I know that's where the fish run, so I gotta get my my bait in there. Get that bite so i probably gotta go about chest deep and then do the same thing i'm just gonna throw the big rods out there like this maybe maybe i'll just wait all of them out i don't know i'm very indecisive i've been getting snagged up somewhere out here too so there's something out there snagging me up from casting from the bank so i gotta pass that up too now as deep here here we go hopefully that one got into that channel that I'm talking about or the big orange one in there too. Man, that boy's heavy. I'm gonna have to trade it in. See if I can swap it out for another, for another beef stick like this or something. Or sell it, I don't know. That thing just belongs anchored somewhere on the boat or something to use it for trolling or something. I don't know, that thing's heavy. That was a nice cast. That was way out 
there. Probably go 50, 75 yards. Oh, what is it? It's a little stink bug. Oh no, it's a locust. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta try the locust top water out here. We're on, guys. We're on. He's a monster. Oh, he's a big one. He's a monster. Look at that guy. Whoa. I ripped the hook out of his mouth as I landed him. So I'm talking about. Oh, check him out. Woo! Check him out, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. I just hear him sitting here making a TikTok and boom, he hit it. Man, crushed my finger. Woo! Let me go get my, my measuring board real quick. I was just making a TikTok, waiting there. I smashed it. Yeah. Can't see how big he is. Let me get my measuring board. I never like to get my measuring board before I catch one because then I never hit. It's kind of like bad luck for me if I ever get if I get my stuff down there. I'm gonna keep a fish. him on the measuring board he's a monster he's he's a very dark colored guy he's not I bet you he comes from the depth real deep that's why he and then it's been kind of cloudy and stuff so maybe that's why he doesn't have his gold color on oh my god oh my god look at that look at that 30 
30, 31, 31 and three quarters, boom. Hook out of him without him crushing my hand again. He broke off as I poke flipped him in. Check it out. Check out where he's just barely hooked. Oh my god. That's like a perfect hook set, but barely. Barely got him on the left. Got my hook back. Stringer. All right, guys. I think it was a good call to get in the water, wait fish, get a little wet. It was worth it. So that was a good catch there. As soon as my one-hour timer went off, it hit. Well, as I was reeling it in, my timer was going off. That's crazy. I always get them on the timer. Boom! I'm buzzer the buzzer shot now I'm telling you there's a channel out here that always hits so and the sun broke out too Woo. and I think tore up my finger I need to get some gloves Went total, totally slack. Oh, yeah. There we go. We're on now. We're tight. Yeah. He's big in. We got a double up. I don't know if that one hooked up, but I'm, I'm on this one. Look, there it goes. It's on. The other one's on too.
That's what I'm talking about. He's another good size one. Walk you over here to where I could grab you. This is his spear. <sighs> that one had got hit too, so I'm just gonna leave the bell open. I don't know if he's hooked up. Man, look at this guy here. Ah, come here, buddy. Ah. Whew. This one. What we got? Got 29 right on the money. Boom. 29. Let's go, baby. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Whew. I just saw that line go slack. That's what I'm talking about. Check him out. Whew. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good one. Let's put him on the stringer too. He's gonna go home with us too. Join your friend over there. And I almost had a double up. I almost had this one on too. I don't know what happened, but it just didn't go. It got snagged up somewhere out there, but something had bit this one good too. Whew. Let me let me get this one figured out, unsnagged or whatever happened to it, and I'll get back to y'all here in a minute. Damn, guys, I just I just got my number two. Get that. Let me put that down. I'm tired. I didn't even record this catch, guys. But I got number three right here. Check it out. Man, I'm so tired. I'm so tired, guys. They're just biting. Woo! So, yeah. Let's measure this guy up, see what he's at. Woo! I'm tired. <laughs> They're way out there. Twenty-three and a half. Twenty-three. Check them out. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Cansado. <laughs> so we did it. Finally got a limit of reds out here at the lakes. Out here at Bronick Lake, my first limit ever on my by myself. Oh my god, I'm so tired from just running from this from that rod, then to the big one. And then I just finished had waiting, so I just had got back in. Oh my god, I was out of breath. I'm sorry I didn't record the last one. I guess I turned off my GoPro thinking I was turning it on. But he was the smaller one, so he didn't put up too much of a big fight. I even thought I lost him a couple times. So, but yeah, he was good. So, I'm going to catch one more time. Maybe we'll, 
we'll let one go and we'll see what happens. So I'll catch out here in a bit. Maybe we'll just continue to fish for fun, see, see if we could get into that school over there and just kind of catch and release from here on out. So I'm gonna donate one to this older gentleman. He's been out here all day, all morning, almost at the same time that I've been out here. Uh, he said he wished he could fish a little longer, but he's a little older, so he's saying it's getting too hot for him. So I'm just gonna donate, donate him one so he could go home and, and get himself, fix himself up a nice little red like that so we'll give him this one the smaller one se va a quedar otro ratito si si no más para no más pescar que más pesco pero yo ya no me voy a quedar con pescado Ahí está. Muchas gracias. Sí, ¿sí? Gracias. Sí. Estuvo mucho caldito. Pero, okay. sí. Muchas gracias. Sí, de nada. Que pase un buen día. Here we go, guys. So I just donated that gentleman one of my fish. One of the smaller ones, the 23 inch one. But yeah, he's been out here grinding. Um, I know the feeling of coming out here and not catching and you come out here with the intent that you're gonna catch a big one or at least catch something so you could go home and eat. Um, so now at least he gets to go home and enjoy uh, a fish. He said he's gonna make himself a, a fish soup. So I never made one, but maybe I'll look it up. Or maybe I, when I run into him again out here, I'll get his recipe for that fish soup. But yeah, so. But yeah, so, so I'm out here catching. That's gonna be more than more than enough for me. So, but yeah, but we're just gonna. Alright, guys. So I'm all done for today. I caught my limit today. I caught three. I think 29, uh, 29 and a half, a 31 and three quarters, and a 23. But y'all saw me donate one to that gentleman. So I'm gonna take two home. Um, I might don't I might give another one away to one of my buddies that he's been asking for one. But yeah. If he doesn't if he doesn't want it then I'm gonna eat him up. But yeah. So it was a great day today out here on the water and I haven't been out here like in about three about three weeks, four weeks just because of all the rain. But yeah, so but it paid off. It paid off to wake up in the morning. My little boy's gonna be mad because I told him, wake up 5:30 in the morning, let's hit the water. I woke up a little late, so he had an extra hour to sleep. He still didn't want to come, so he missed out on a great day. But I'm sure he'll come next time. But, but to everybody that's here watching, that watch my videos, that been supporting the channel, thank y'all very much. I love y'all very much. We're on the road to 1,000. Um, so let's keep the channel growing. Keep sharing it, liking, commenting. I'll answer any questions y'all have or whatever as best as I can. But I really appreciate y'all support. Much love.